was so cool. Okay, spoiler alert for real. Now, Captain Marvel comes out March 8th, but recently this toy hit store shelves, and some say it might give away a major plot twist. And this isn't the first time something like this has happened. Movie merchandise spoilers are on the hot list. Merchandise, action figures, and toy tie-ins can be a great way to boost fans' enjoyment of a movie. Well, unless they completely spoil it. Unfortunately, when they do that, that one scene that's super cool, that's the scene they spoil because they want to hook you with that scene. Jeff Pena, a comics and toy expert at Samurai Comics, tells us about three times movie merch spilled the beans before the film came out. For starters, there's no franchise more perfect for a toy tie-in than Toy Story, especially when it comes from Lego. You are a toy! But before Toy Story 3 came out, Lego released a set called Trash Compactor Escape, which gave away the main twist in the movie. Where's your kid now, Sheriff? The toy set had a... Uh refer to Lots of Hug and Mare as the evil villain. Not only did it reveal that the lovable Lunk was the villain, but it did so well giving away the major action plot point at the end. Lego, ah, bless him. Now, if you're a fan of Marvel's Avengers series, then potential spoilers are everywhere when it comes to toys. And it landed on the last film, Infinity War, like a bomb. After Thor's hammer is blown to bits in the previous film, fans were heartbroken. Sounds like you had a pretty special and intimate relationship with this hammer and that losing it was almost comparable to losing a loved one. It's a nice way of putting it. And fans eagerly awaited the next Avengers movie to see what Thor's new weapon would be. However, ahead of Infinity War's release, a Thor action figure hit the shelves revealing his new weapon that was designed to kill the major villain. He is getting that tool to go kill Thanos. So why would you not conceal a little bit of that? Finally, going way back to 1999, the mother of all spoilers was revealed for Star Wars, The Phantom Menace, 16 years after the last Star Wars film came out. <laughs> we have no clue what's going on. We know Obi-Wan's in there. We know Anakin's the little kid. And we see Qui-Gon, who's Liam Neeson. But a month before the release of the movie, the CD soundtrack was shipped to stores, and fans, craving anything new, got more than they bargained for. I just wanted to see what the track listings were, because I wanted something. It's a trap! And there it was, like, oh, Qui-Gon's death. And I'm like, you, are, are you kidding me? No! You had one job. Keep it shrouded in mystery for four weeks, and they couldn't do that. We're getting spoiled rotten with a look at movie tie-ins that didn't come with a spoiler warning on the hot list.